I really want to show y'all pets today, but uh, somebody is not cooperating, fun I wasn't going to name any names, but, uh, you know. <laughs> Instead, I can actually finish something that I started, which is pretty important. Uh, a couple things. I never finished my tour of the city, which we need to do to get back home. Because we need to get back home and start building up home, because purges are working. And purges are purging, and my place is not safe. <laughs> This is not safe at all. So welcome everybody to Friday Night Conan Exiles. And of course we're going to be trying to survive in this sandbox. And we're going to see how well that goes today. Oh, that freaked me out for a second. I was like, oh come on, I know it was just working and suddenly the screen was black. Alright, so this is where we left off. Oh, look, it's nice and bright. It's not nighttime quite yet, but the shadows are moving quickly. Alright. Oh, hey. We loaded back in at the box. Anything worth grabbing? All of it. And I'm over encumbered now. Wait, does it make you drop stuff now? When you're over encumbered? No. Then I accidentally dropped stuff. Which I need to find a way to actually figure out something to drop. Uh, we don't need stone. Get rid of that. So, petrified flesh now has a timer. It does! Oh, man. Yeah, it's like one day per, but it's still gonna... So, I mean, that's longer than most food, but it's still gonna decay on you. Yeah, it is. I'm thinking, should I dump the... Dump the bone? I don't want to dump the glass. The glass doesn't even weigh that much. don't want to get rid of the steel bars or the iron bars, really. I want to get rid of anything that's a decoration. <clears throat> so, yeah, I guess bone. Oh, but I need the bone to make that. The I foundation's probably good to get rid of. You're not going to need that anytime soon. Yeah, I built this and then I need to use it on my house. Yeah, but you can build it again some other time. It's just, it's being heavy in your inventory right now. That's true. Yeah, but Natalia's right. There's nothing I want to drop. And the problem with that one being that there's no stone around my house, which is why I normally save it. What if I split the stack of bone and drop the bone? I get to 98%. That at least lets me, lets me move again. Can I climb? Well, you can still climb. If we find any more loot boxes, might be in a lot of trouble. All right, now I'm trying to look. We've covered all of that ground. All the way up to right there. So maybe we should circle around. Is that what we're going to try? Oh, we did that whole middle part over there, though. We did that house. I think. It was only that one we did. No, we did that one. Oh, crud. No, I don't remember. I... Did you do that one by the water? Maybe not, but... Ugh. We know which way we're going. I think you totally should be able to stand on that window ledge. Let's see. My, oh, and I just jumped over the edge.
Yeah, we already talked to this guy, didn't we? I'm not sure. I think I was out of town for your last Conan stream. <laughs> so was I, <laughs> actually. Yeah, I'm trying to remember if we got that middle one right there. Well, that one we can get into, so we'll... Looks familiar. I know how to check. Oh wait, I don't remember these guys. Dancing pack dude. Okay. Let's see, we did that one. I know we did that one. This one, the way to check would be if there is a box in one specific spot. It actually does not look like we've done this one. Because there wasn't a box where I thought it would be. This whole little, no, this whole little Pueblo circle. Look at this with their own little, you know, pond. I like that. Oh, there we go. Always good to break your, whoa, is that supposed to be a door? Like seriously? Did somebody make a mistake there? And when they created these for illusions, did they kind of forget to uh, take into case, you know, account scaling? Oh, oh we'll make it look like it's farther up by making the door. <laughs> no, I think it's supposed to be a window. I don't know, had a doorknob and everything. Looks dory. Yeah, there's definitely at least one other person you haven't talked to yet. Oh yeah, there was one, there's somebody in the house right in there, looked like Conan actually. Yeah, this is pretty neat. Whoops, that was a bit more of a jump than I intended, but... Really? That was... That wasn't a big jump. What are you talking about? See, that's recessed in that, like, a door. That's not a window. It's onto a balcony. Those are supposed to be doors. There are munchkins living in this land. They're probably the lollipop guild people. Oh. All right. Let's see what we got in this chest. Oh, we want more water orbs. A few more steel bars. A few more iron bars. 103%, huh? I'll think of something to give away in a minute. Yeah, this one was the one where I was like, um, I need to find my way home and come back. 
That's why I was like, I need to just teleport home and come back so that I can actually continue with my touring adventures. Yeah, I'll get rid of something. What can I get rid of? Uh, arrow doesn't weigh anything. Bunch of crystal. Goy goop doesn't weigh anything. No, oh, really, it's the building stuff. And the bones. Curses. And these weapons. I'm down to only 102. Well, maybe I'll just make a couple more glowing sticks. How much do they weigh? It's a good question. How much does a glowing stick weigh? 0.15 versus. <coughs> There's a Monty Python joke in there somewhere. <laughs> no. All right, we'll just have three so we have them on us. Drop arrows because we don't need. Oh, I have coal too. Oh, it didn't help. Still not helping, so we're just gonna walk for a while. I don't wanna, okay. Boo, I got rid of the foundations. Gonna wanna come back for those. <laughs> oh, there's a little hut there. Guess we should check out the hut. See if there's anyone named Jabba there. <gasps> Oh, of course, there's a box. Aw, oh, come on. No. No. Alright, I'm gonna like not loot this one. Oops. I'm gonna not loot it. I'm gonna try not to drown too. Alright, now we gotta head back over to the open house. Which. Oh, look at this. Over encumbered, you can still swim well. Oh, we just made a discovery. I'll think of something. What are you staring at? That's right, buddy. Kind of lost track where I... Alright, so... Where I haven't been is over here. Yeah, Oompa Loompas. Yeah, they probably live there. Hey, for Texan. Yeah, I'm just going to run out of salmon a lot. I'm just going to dump something. Possibly the bars. Let's see, there's a door. It's like, I'm going to have to get a pie again to reorient myself to where the heck I was. Do you have any skill points to spend? 
Oh, probably a whole bunch. Uh, yeah, a few. Yeah, you could up your encumbrance a little bit. There we go. Alright, so I actually just now skipped all this area. Because over here is where we walked back in. With this guy. Haha! -ha. And this is the open doorway we need to be sure to check out. Yep, I was right. I saw him through the doorway. So you live, and we meet again. Tell me, have you had a good chance to look around? Seen your fill of these exiled lands? <laughs> it's not too late to get back on that crucifix. I wandered for a while after I pulled you from that cross. In the south, I found desperate souls and Dafari man-eaters. In the east, apes that walked like men among the overgrown ruins of an ancient city. I found an amphitheater where the ancient dead walked and the memories of ancient battles stained the sand. It stank of sorcery. So I left. I have traveled far and seen much. From the glittering ice of Asgard to the jungle expanses of the Black Kingdoms. I have been thief, pirate, and mercenary. But nowhere have I seen gods as I see them in this land. These avatars that stalk and spread destruction in their wake. These are not gods. These are what men want gods to be. Weapons. <laughs> Kari's going to be dancing up there. <laughs> there is a woman. I freed her from the cross just as I did you. I followed her trail across the exiled lands. I missed her here by a scant few hours. No, you didn't. She's she right over in the other building. The map room and a way to free herself from the exiled lands. Her trail ended in the map room. She was gone and all of her companions slaughtered. Listen, if you have news of Rasma of Shem, let me know. Uh, she's in the other room? Ah, what do I know of sorcerers and their feuds? <laughs> I do not dabble in the hey, dark Hey, Fort, arts. big fan of the Sight and Podcast. So awesome to have Whoever you here. and whatever put you here is a wielder of the dark arts. You were like a wolf in a trap. You struggle to flee in the end. In the end. Kill you. Be smarter. Find out what they want, then hold it close. They will come for it. And then your jaws around their throat. <laughs> <laughs> Just remember this. If you do succeed. If you do manage to find a way to remove your bracelet and leave the exiled lands, you will have to make a choice. Stay and be the hero of your own story. Or leave and risk losing it all. The choice will be yours. At Chakarama. Choose wisely. Any fool can see that you need answers left hanging for the vultures on that cross. A cursed bracelet that keeps you trapped in this place. Everybody trying to kill each other. I should leave you all to your fate. I don't have the stomach for sorcery. Give me a foe that I can strike with cold iron. Ah! I'll be here a while. His wine tastes like boiled camel's piss and the bread's half weevil, but... I'm comfortable enough. If you have questions, ask. 
Wow, he goes on for a long time, doesn't he? I wandered he? for a while after I pulled you from. Oh yeah, he has a lot to say. In the south, I found now we've just uh, gotten back to the. East, Oh, Hannah the Broker. My stock is limited, the so by now. Walk, and the memories of ancient battle stain the sand. Mystery meat soup. May such guide your steps. Go I left. What'll it be? Ale. I'll Nobody. have more in stock tomorrow. Nobody else actually wants to talk. Yeah, they don't seem to actually be talking. Can I get to you? They should at least say one thing, but... Any dancers want to talk? Yeah, not that kind of talk, honey. <laughs> Alright. So time to continue our search of the city here. Oh, come on, another box, really? Oh. Oops. What kind of things do we have in this one? Oh, look. More steel bars, more I'm gonna steal the leather. I'm gonna try, okay, maybe the, maybe the bars too. Charlotte's Journal number one. Not to make the search infinite, but there are lore on sand colored parchments on the sand colored ground. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, I'm probably not going to find all of that. My expertise in bedroom acrobatics will be of little use to the old fool. Why, that little harlot, like, haunts everywhere, doesn't she? Hmm. Anything worth seeing up here? So next time is going to be more exciting. We're going to check out the new dungeon. We're going to probably show off the uh, healing arrows. Practice shooting your friends in the face to make them feel better. Well, that's not exactly how you do it, but it's close enough. Purges. Maybe we can be around when another purge happens for... The carrier. Yeah, they were, they were not happy. We got attacked by spiders. Of course, it had to be spiders. Giant, giant spiders. At least one of them was. Yeah, it was like a whole bunch of little spiders, and then one big giant spider. twice as tall as we were. Yeah, I saw the picture. There are bigger ones. Yes. Oh, I've discovered Temple Quarter. We're in a new zone of the city. Oh, look at that. Oh, there's is that like an iron chest down there? We're definitely going to have to look in that. But 
we'll make sure we check out all these rooftops. And I'm sad about the lack of doors that you can actually get into. I mean, that depresses me. There's some coal. Fun feeling a little bit like Spider Man running around the city. <laughs> Some people. Um, are you guys trying to look nonchalant because staring at the wall really doesn't make you look less suspicious? Yeah, we're just going to stand here, stare at the wall. It's not going to look like anything's going on over here. image. Let's go see if we learn anything cool up here. We learn that there is an invisible top. Aw, it's not a chest. Press E to interact. With who? With what? Where? With the altar, I think. Yeah, I tried. It didn't come back. There is a loot chest here. Oh, wow. Okay. Have they fixed the bug where you don't have to keep closing the... Spamming my E button. Proceed to interact came up. There it is. E, 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 E. Okay, what's actually supposed to happen? Isn't it a recipe or something? It might just be the religion. Proceed to interact. I think it already it just teaches you set and you probably already know set. I don't know, do I? Snakes and moonlight. I don't know that I've learned it since the Things were redone. Okay, so what's the... How do I check my religions? It's one of the skills. It's under feet. It is under feet. There it is. Oh, I guess... No, you don't. Well, it's saying I can unlock it for 50. Yeah, but you don't want to. Yeah, no. Yeah, I've got Durketto and Mitra is all I have. So...
So the answer is nothing. <laughs> the answer is for MJ, nothing. That's not doing anything for me either. Well, remember how I press D and I can't actually, um, I couldn't even attune to the, the way shrine, waypoint, whatever things. So. I have suspicions that this might be related. Pressy, holdy, hitty, slappy, poundy. Glad little guy's in here because his favorite sound is E and he runs around E. And also, my daughter thought it was funny to let him say epoch instead of epic. Guess what he's run around yelling for like a month now. Epoch, epoch. Oh, and now he's made ehawk. And he feels so clever that he's made up this awesome word ehawk. <laughs> such a cutie. So you haven't, did you learn set? Um, I already know all the religions, so I'm not sure. So that wouldn't do anything for you. Do you know it by coming and learning it here? I can't remember. Probably. Our server's been going a while. Ooh. Oh, found a priest, huh? Natalia says you found a priest. Maybe, oh, I was going to say, maybe it only does something if you interact with it when you know it or a certain level or something. I don't know. Yeah, this isn't where it is. I'm not sure what. But something. It, it might have done something at some point, but it's definitely not doing anything now. So. Yeah, this guy's here like, hmm, I'm thinking. Look at that. Look at the chain he has between his nipples. Somebody says, uh, yank your chain. This guy is going to have a miserable time. The set priest. Now, the set priest who teaches you the religion, I oh, think he's in. Don't tell me in, where. Don't tell me no, where. No, I'm not going to tell you where. But he's in He's in one of the pre launch, er, post launch areas. So this is a pre launch area. So it's yeah. possible that but they, they also, moved it. Oh, well, maybe. But, well, no, this didn't exist in the, ci the city pre-launch. The city wasn't an NPC city's pre-launch. True. This is new here, too. This is all new. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, little guy is just loving the... Loving that word. E is his favorite sound. Like, seriously, E. He thinks E is, is amazing. I tried to light you up with an arrow, but they don't work here. Oh, because they don't? Because no, the in the city, it, no, in the city, it's, um, you can't use oh. damaging or anything that actually does anything here. Really? Yeah. It's a safe zone. like possible crafting benches here. Yeah. Might help if I uh, put my... Oh, not one you can use. Hi, dude. Ah, did you see he like turned and nodded to me? Goodness, we're st I mean, every time you try to go around one way to look at something, then there's some other way that you've missed. Oh. It's a big city. Yep. It's like if I'm going around the end. Oh, well, I'm kind of stuck. 
like you're going around the okay oh another box how oh, there's a lot of loot crates here so many loot crates it's like we're going to the city to go shopping and by shopping we mean empty everything that isn't locked Vortex, <laughs> a pocket set of a pocket. Almost 30 years ago. You're not old. Alright, so let's see. We haven't gone any of this middle or those sides. We haven't. Oh, wow. This is so hard to try to. All right, we'll check out this one with the bridge across the two. Because we already did that little house over there. Actually, we didn't climb on top of it, so we just talked to uh, Mr. Conan Man. Mr. Conan! Oh, that's not what I meant to do at all. That was not good. It was very much not what I intended to do. Can I, like, not? There we go. Dizzy from thirst. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I was trying to walk across this. That didn't succeed very well. Come on, that wasn't any kind of a drop. The mysteries of fall damage cannot be quantified. Oh, yeah. It's so weird. Little tiny drops, like, maul you and a great big one. You're like, oh, hey, I'm going to die from this. What? No damage? Okay. Wow, I can climb right through that like a boss. I can peek at Conan from the windows here. All right, we're gonna jump in the water here. All right. All right, so now we've cleared the center stuff, that house. Didn't we check out that one? Did we not? No. Too many crickets, man. This place is so big. Alright. I don't think we looked at that stuff with the tower. Oh, look, there's a guy over there. No, we haven't been there. See, we're going more in the middle again. Oh, well, maybe we did. I kind of remember running across that. Did we check this one out up there? Well, we definitely didn't come where these two horns were. And I also, there we go. Kind of bummed you can't, like, blow the horns. All 
All right, that's where the girl's ghost popped up, I think. Yeah, there's a, there are horns, but you have to craft them yourself. Yeah, you have to put them on your property. Alright, now is this the one we haven't looked at yet? We were over there. Yeah, this is where it's really confusing. Nice. There's the one where the guy looked at the guy and he was in between. Where was that? Guy standing on the rooftops. Where's he at? So I'm like, no, I definitely haven't been there because I didn't see that guy before. And I can't figure out where he is. Again. So gonna miss more of the city. I thought he was right right up there. Bill. All right, we've been here. Oh, there's a chest over there. Fancy looking one. Wait, don't tell me you can't open it. There we go. Wait, where'd the. Oh, what's that? Weapon. More bark. More steel bars. I'm at 98 now. I'm leaving the arrows, though. I mean, see? I'm showing some restraint. <laughs> hey, can you walk across these uh, ropes? Probably not. Yeah, hence my <laughs> moving that. Whoa. Oh, Sandstorm. No. I'm in shelter here. Or so it says. You probably want to eat something. You're. I did. I'm waiting to... Oh, look at that. Yeah, that looks, looks less like a sandstorm and more like, you know, fiery depths of hell. It's such a cool effect, though. 
It really is. I'm looking for my sandstorm mask. There it is. Yeah. I mean, when it's happening, it's like, eh, but when it's rolling up on you, that's just really pretty. I like standing there, ooh, oncoming death. Screenshot, 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 screenshot. <laughs> mm. I should have put mine with my back to it and gotten a picture of my my character. And then it says, when I bring my fury, rah, you know, would have been a good <laughs> caption. Whoa, there is a stick flying at my eyeball. Yeah, I'm watching it'll be dark or something afterwards and I won't be able to... I'm determined to finish the city tonight. I mean, we won't have investigated every nook and cranny, but at least you guys will have a pretty thorough idea. I think we've reached an edge over here. So we'll investigate the edge and then. Oh. Oops, oops, just come. Oh. Ooh, that would have been bad. Wait, whose house is this? And then am I gonna get shot? You're gonna get shot. I got shot by like five people. Whose is it? Is it Mortals, Jerseys? It's probably Mortal or Brams. I can't get close enough to say for sure. Let me see if I can find a door that doesn't get me attacked. There's a door here. There's an opening even. There's a sign on it. Uh-oh. Wait, they're running after you. Ah! Sepamuro Academy of Dance and Fine Arts. It's jerseys. All right. I think I'm gonna die. What? No! They are all wearing the exact same armor I am and... Oh, man. Oh yeah, I'm dead. Oh no. It's okay, I'd rather die than not kill his people. Yeah. They're probably getting hungry. I wonder if his break's over yet. I made it away. Oh yeah, I think it is because you should really go see uh, Riverwatch. Before the end of the stream. <laughs> He's made a lot of changes to it. Wow, I, I made it out of there with like 10 hit points. Uh, so whose house is that one? I'll have to heal first. <laughs> yeah, that's probably Brahms. Wow, big thing over there. Yeah, because he's got the big wheels and everything. That's... That's Brahms. That one's been there for a while. No, this is Mortal Wears. Is Mortal? Okay. I went in, it said Mortal Wears. Yeah. Wheel of pain, so. He doesn't have anybody guarding. This is a, a friendly place. 
drink water from a well. Oh, I just completed a step. Wait. I heard somebody hoo-yaw me, but... So, yeah, we definitely left the city there. So, these little things are on the outskirts. Yeah, and then our... Our house is a little west of here, or, yeah. This looks like a sign, like somebody, there should be a sign here. There's nothing written on it. Oh! Did you get all healed up? Alright, so we made it to this side of the city. Where's how much of the interior ish have we missed then? It's so hard to tell. Yeah, it all looks alike. <laughs> well, we made it down to the water there, so I guess we climbed up on that one. I think you've been through most of it. How many map points have you found? Ah, uh, that's a good question. Oh, I know I haven't done this whole side and stuff over here. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so you've got all of the map points. Yeah, but I haven't been to anything over here yet. We're actually making... Oh, because see, there's a whole bunch of the city over there. There's still all of that over there. Like, you think you're close to the edge. And they put things up on roofs, so you don't want to not go to somewhere... Oh, hi, Box! Like boxes. Obsidian, huh? Razor arrows. Yeah, I'm way over uh, over encumbered now. Oh, there's a box down there that I think I didn't close. Or at least it's open. Oh, wow. I actually skirted around this one, guys. go down and close it. There we go. I don't know what I'd be willing to yeah, because here's the dancing guys. Still think some of these doors should open, man. Or at least the kegs. Kegs should open, right? My strength is bad. Oh, now I found a guy standing. Actually, it's a woman standing on the roof. She's looking at our house. Max carry weight is increased by 10% of this pack mule. Hmm. So 
somebody has arrows stuck in them? Oh, that was probably you. I did. <laughs> All right, so we come around there. You see that there's nothing that way, but then the city takes a turn and heads that way. So we explored, I think we mostly jumped around that thing. I think that's the one that has a box right there in front of us. Unless it's that one over there. No, because that one has plants. Well, we hopped around on that one a little bit, right? Yeah, I I think you've pretty much seen everything. Yeah, no, the entire half there, over there. We haven't gone anything over there, so. All right, here we go. dude by a tree. Whoa, big dude. No, oh, it's just somebody near somebody kneeling. It's a Conan almost look alike. Yeah, this is the direction of town I never went to. See all of that over there. All of that. Oh my goodness. Oh, let's see if we can make some quick work of the night before it light before it disappears into night. This person's just kind of standing here on the roof. So that's considered. There's one of the gate. Oh, what's that doorway? You guys see how different that doorway looks? That's, I think that's the gate to the west. I think I was right just there a second ago. But yeah, that doorway looks really cool. Oh, no. It doesn't look like that when you get up close to it. But it, yeah, it does have this red sandstone-y look. From a distance, it's really trippy. Look at this. Munchkin doors, man. Munchkin doors. Or they set that, that one down a little too low in the... The sands. Oh, yeah. Look at them from a distance. I guess it's they're not totally rendered in. I thought they were some kind of cool thing. in the dark. <laughs> By the light of the moon, I swear. Like, I don't want to stay on walls too long because nobody can see anything when I do that. Oh, there's somebody just kind of standing out here. 
You want to talk? Look at my perfectly chiseled chin. Er, guess he doesn't want to talk. really wish you could get into more places. Yeah, who would use a regular torch once you can get the goop? It's so much brighter. Now, the rest of that, we actually ran into that during another thing. So, while I technically haven't showed that off during the tour... Look at this, nobody's been in or out this door in a while. You're just walking around, okay. Oh, here's some girl. Staring off that way. Lissa, oh, the longbow. Natalia likes the regular torches. Well, that's okay. I actually have a thing more for white lights. Lights that are yellowish uh, tend to bother my eyes more. Another big old stack of places to check out here. Doesn't seem to be anything that way. So I think it's kind of funny that we found her before we found Conan. Be like, no, no, she's right over here, really. Yeah, I think they just have Conan there because you can get to the city before doing her dungeon, so. Uh, and her her building is locked unless you have her key. Well, I could hand it to Conan, you know. I, I owe him, right? <laughs> Jeez, I get to the top of this rise and the music moves to burn. Yeah, I like these ones that have people on the top. I can be like, okay, I know that. I know I went to that one. <laughs> I know I recognize that building's roof. I think we did all over there. Yeah, so there's stuff to find on the ground, too, people. But I've been focusing on the rooftops. In my Spider-Man crazy ways. Yeah, this used to be quite the dangerous place to walk into. Of course, the last time I came in here was probably while it was still aggro. Yeah, I don't think those Sedites attack anymore. They used to just all attack you. Alright, 
I was gonna say someone just yelled at me. Uh, or maybe they uh, do. They're trying to. Uh, okay. There's a. There are two boxes in there. Well, I guess now's the time to have a bow and arrow. I guess they do still attack you. <laughs> but there's loot there. Wait, are they attacking you? No, I don't think I'm anywhere near you. I forget are, where it is. What are they attacking? Oh, I think that's Natalia attacking them. Alright, don't pick up the... Oh... Yes, 99. I need to close this chest. Encumbered again, huh? Must mean that I need to go in and spend another three points in encumbrance. I'm just going to bump me right to there. Now I have 10 left out of 40. Ha <laughs> ha. That's all that matters. Yeah. So apparently it's all safe now. My guardian angel has come and... Oh, Natalia, I can make a box for you. No, this is more fun. Oh, wow. No, that's not a box. That's a... Now there's just some little houses. Yeah, those those guys really went after somebody and then you heard all the gurgly gurgly I'm dying sounds. See there I don't know that I went to that middle one. I know I didn't go to... Let's check it out. Yeah, when to run around an NPC, NPC city takes you over two hours. I mean, that's something. All right, now this is the one side, okay. That wasn't upsetting the locals. Whoops, stop sprinting before you try to climb, MJ. That doesn't work. Hey, look at that door there. I think we've almost worked our way around. Whoa, 
new box. A number of times MJ has been encumbered today. We should have had an encumbered counter. Thankfully, you can still climb when encumbered. You may not be able to run. But you can still climb. Because that's the door we came in over there. And what's-her-face is down in those buildings. So I think we finally come full circle, everyone. Yeah, I think that's... You've went all the way around because you got back to where they are angry and not happy. suddenly having a problem with not going the direction I want to go. Must have hit V. I guess. Oh, there's a box under me. I'm trying to figure. So we found a recipe, we found a interact but nothing happened item. Oops. Hate when I accidentally. Yes, yes, over and come. as a gateway. And yeah, isn't her building just right there? Here are these guys. I remember climbing all around these. These buildings. So yeah. I guess I think I climbed all over these buildings. Yeah, I'm yeah, I remember that because I remember these guys in the fire. So we made it. It only took us for almost two and a half hours. We probably still missed a couple boxes or something. I'm willing to bet we missed one or two. And of course, little lore things. We've only picked up one or two of those. I don't know. 
know, I like that they made this a uh, NPC town. It's made it uh, an interesting area, a safe area, so I guess no matter what server you're on. So we're on PvP, so we can't kill each other here. And we're back. There. How's that for a face? Yeah. Wait, how long has my head been off? Oh, who even knows? <laughs> Oh, so they patched in the patch to prepare for pets. I feel like I need to start saying Peter Piper picked up. <laughs> they patched in the patch to prepare for pets. How many patches to prepare for pets must they patch before we procure our pets? <laughs> Seriously, how long before we get the pets? Do we have it's any guesses? supposed to be like a week. Supposed to be. I mean, like, do we have real guesses? Is the... They don't get a given exact date, but they said about a week. Mm -hmm. That's but probably this, smart of them. This is time to do the dungeon that you you need to do to unlock pets. So. Mm, true. Because obviously, if everybody tried to rush the servers right away, it would just be a mess, especially on PvP servers. Yeah. Except for our server, where, you know, ten people can't really rush. <laughs> no. So, yeah, the plan is that we will do the dungeon next week. And that will prepare us for pets. Because I'm really excited to show that off. I've, I'm already planning my survivalist post for that. The only problem is it might get bumped out to like November because of all the different Halloween guides and stuff. <laughs> May not make it in an October one, uh, but but it might. We'll have to see about that. Um, I mean, hey, going hunting for black cats, that sounds very Halloween-y to me, right? Perfect. Ooh, I'm excited. I, I am very excited for the pets. So, I don't know about everybody else, but very excited for pets. And you get to hunt at, uh, werewolves, so. Um, well, you know, like this. Eh. Well, they're not werewolves, they're were things. I'm more excited for pets. <laughs> Come on, MJ loves pets. We all know that. Oh, dear. Oh, because of the vanity camera. I was like, why can I not see my face at all? MJ has no face anymore! Uh, so that is that is our plan for next time. Uh, which day the next time will be, I'm not exactly sure. So you guys will have to keep an eye on the calendar to figure that one out. Uh, it might just go ahead and be a Friday, or it might bump in, you know, Wednesday or Monday. I mean, I don't know. There's, There are so many games. Guys, I have not counting the single-player ones. I seriously have over 100 games on my, my computer right now. And I don't have a lot of single-player ones, but I do have, you know... 20 or 30 or some I don't know. <laughs> I stopped counting. There are so many games and only so many slots I get to stream. And we are going into Halloween. So we need to do the dungeon. The dungeon shouldn't be too long. So maybe we should wait. Wait. Are they going to do the wear things same time as the pets? No, the, the dungeon is where you get the wear that that's it the dungeon is a whole bunch of were jackals oh good oh good okay i just wanted to make sure there so we can do that and that'll be very halloween-esque yeah we can add that to our halloween stuff <laughs> for sure and yeah because be ready because we'll have the 
the whole collection of Mop Halloween 2018 that we are still 2018, right? Oh my gosh, I'm this is bad. I suddenly lost what year we're in. <laughs> I think MJ needs to go take a nap. Uh, so keep an eye out on the calendar, guys, for that so we know that we're going to be doing it. Just don't know exactly which day because one of our group actually is, you know, off skedaddling around Ireland right now. and uh, or, or he might still be on the planes for it. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure. Uh, so we might want to wait till he gets back or we'll run it through with him later. Don't know yet. Don't know what's going to happen, but to know when it does, when it gets scheduled, check out the OPTV calendar on massivelyop.com. Read up on all the Conan stuff. If you guys are interested in Conan, uh, there are a lot of servers out there. There are a lot of different rule sets and stuff that uh, different people are doing. Contact me. There's my Twitter if you want to know any information about this server. Uh, this is actually a personal server, but I invite the peoples to come on it. You can get through that through, uh, just take a look at my Patreon. And, of course, Twitter, you can follow what's happening when, get the news, all that good stuff. Also, you get thanked for being a helpful supporter and stuff on Twitters, as well as here on streams. You know why? You know why I know that? Because I'm doing it right now. You guys are fantastic, and I love you all. Thank you for supporting Stay safe this Friday night because I want to see you all here again tomorrow on Saturday for more sandboxy and crazy goodness. So we'll talk to you later. Have fun, but not so much fun that it becomes unfun. Night, everyone. <laughs>